What's up everyone? I'm getting a lot of requests for my smoothie recipe now, or recipes that I use. Uh, I mix it up some, but I usually go with the same one because I just like it and, then, and I don't get burned out having it. And I, me again, I, I was called selfish last week, like I don't care about people, but I mean, I care about health a lot. And I think the number one thing you can do is take care of your body by eating healthy and exercising. I know that can be controversial and uh, I can get in trouble for saying that because it's, it's not what everyone agrees with these days, but that's what I think, that's my belief and that's how it's gonna be. All right, smoothie. First thing, blender. Um, I've had the Ninja, I've smoked that thing in a year. It burnt out, it was garbage. So I'm a big fan of the Blendtec or the Vitamix. I know they're a little expensive, but you can find, find them uh, on sale like around Black Friday. I'd be looking this month. Uh, because they blend on a whole nother level. I didn't believe it until I got one. So that's all I'm gonna say about that. I use the blend tech. Okay, first thing I use, Olivia spinach, just what I use. So I take my pitcher and I fill it about half full. I like a lot of greens. I always pick a green, it doesn't matter if it's spinach, sometimes cilantro, parsley, uh, collard greens, but usually I just go with spinach. You know, kale is included, but this is easy. So I just fill it up about half full. Now I use uh, something sweet for flavor. I go with a lime because it's the least amount of sugar. I used to do pineapple or an apple and a lime, but now that I'm used to uh, less sugar, I just go with a lime. But put any fruit you want. I definitely recommend cutting an apple up or some pineapple if this is your first time so it's more sweet. So the lime, I hurry up. And I'm gonna do this live here just to show you it doesn't take long to uh, make this smoothie at all. I also may cut my finger off in the process because I'm trying to go speedy, but I'll try not to do that. So, but yeah, the lime, I just, you know, cut the rind off. It's important to have a knife that's pretty sharp so it's nice and easy, and you go from there. All right, cool. So I throw this thing in the blender, perfect. Uh, ginger root, I really like ginger root. It's up to you. I, I keep putting more and more as I go, so. Uh, I'd start with a small piece and then increase from there. It's pretty strong, but I love it. Avocado. This is the difference maker, okay? If you don't want a frothy um, smoothie, this prevents it, right? The fat in this avocado really helps keep it together and makes it like a, a, a awesome like creamsicle pr pretty much. So it's so good to have this. So I use the entire thing, well, the entire avocado, take the pit out, get rid of that. And then I just scoop this out, throw it in, double check. I, you know, if any brown, I throw it out, but yeah, this one seems like to be a good one. So I'm excited about it. Nice. So, yep, just scoop this out, avocado, we're good. Uh, and then I have this already pre-washed mint leaves. I love mint leaves in this. It just gives it a little added flavor. So I throw this in. Perfect. Now this used to be what I only used to do. And then I top it off with water. I'd fill it half full to the line right here to 105, just below Blendtec. But now that I use it as kind of a meal replacement, um, I add some more things into it. So I'm going to show you that now. Okay, I, I would normally do water and ice, blend it, but... I'll add this. So I like uh, vanilla protein powder. And I think this goes excellent with the avocado and the mint leaves, like the vanilla mint, it's so good. So Jaro Formulas is the brand I use. It's not chalky, it blends the best in my opinion. It's a Whole Foods brand. So it's easily to order too because on Amazon, right? So just what I do, it depends. Sometimes one, two scoops, depends how much I'm training. Today, I did not lift yet. So I'm gonna go one scoop, all right? Uh, this makes enough for, for my wife and I. It's two mason jars, about 64 ounces. Next thing I do, glutamine. I do glutamine because uh, I think this is really good for recovery. This is only, I think, if your exercise routine, you're training quite a bit. This helps prevent soreness and, and aids recovery a lot. So, uh, and if you don't know, I mean, just again, just do a little bit of research on your own Google uh, and uh, See if glutamine is good for you, but again, general formula, same thing because there's no artificial flavorings or preservatives. Uh, collagen powder, I like collagen powder, healthy skin, healthy nails, look young. I know I look like I'm 28, 
and it, it's all because of this all right so collagen powder i put a scoop or two in this and it makes the wife happy she likes when i use it so uh, throw that in there if you want if not uh do whatever amazon buy optimal and it has again zero you know uh preservatives no there's no uh, stay out of, stay away from toxins it's very important to stay away from toxins so be picky on which ones you use the cheap ones sometimes just have all these added artificial uh flavorings and then just for added bonus i've been throwing this in organic greens tons of good stuff in this so many things like some rare green plants that you sometimes won't eat every day like uh wheatgrass for example that's uh very beneficial all right you can look that up too but so I throw a scoop of this in there, um, and that's pretty much it. So that's my everyday morning one right there. I put all these things in, spinach, lime, avocado, ginger root, mint leaves, and then the powders, okay? And I showed you all the powders. Maybe I'll take a picture of everything so you guys can just kind of look at that. Uh, I will fill this with water. So where's my water pitcher? It's over here. So I like using the zero water filter pitcher. And I'll fill this all the way. We'll go to about half full. Yep, right? It looks, maybe it looks gross at first, but don't worry. It's not. And it tastes great, especially if you use maybe some more fruit. All right, again, I, I only use the lime or lemon. Uh, pick what you want. But if you need more sweetener, just throw an apple in there or pineapple. Now I'll put some ice and I'll blend this up. Okay, my blender actually has a smoothie setting. Oh, this thing's in the way. Uh, so I just hit the button and it blends. It takes about a minute. Uh, but I'll, I'll pause the video. I'll blend it. I'll show you what it looks like. All right, so now you see I got the ice in there. I just put, you know, I just put a few cubes in there. Throw this on, turn this on, and then I just hit the smoothie button, let it rip. <laughs> Okay, awesome. So uh, while that was blending, I have enough time to like take my cutting board, uh, ditch the stuff in the trash, right? And then actually clean it off, kind of wipe the knife. And so I'm already kind of cleaned up. I'm just waiting for the blender. Uh, so now this is done. Let me pop the cover over the sink so I don't make any mess. Um, yeah, so this again, you can blend it for a little bit longer, but it's a really nice consistency where it's not frothy at all. Okay, and that's what I really like. I don't like the foam. I like something that's, you know, that's a little more, uh, uh, you know, just the texture is nice and smooth. It's great, it tastes amazing. So, and with the mint in there, vanilla mint, this is the best. Mm. I might go run five miles right now. This is so good. All right, guys. Well, anyways, I hope you enjoyed the video. I make two a day just like this every single time. My blender, the count on it. 1586 so i made 1586 pictures of this stuff a couple of those could have been other drinks but most of them have been smoothies so uh if you have any questions let me know uh but this is my go-to mix it up with any greens you want any fruit you want uh but it's important to try to stay on the lower sugar side so you're not spiking blood sugar especially if your goal is to lose some weight a little bit but that's a whole different topic all right but Peace out. Maybe I'll post some more ones or maybe some mandatory. I'll work out soon. But anyways, have a great day. Later.